Hey everybody, it's Kimberly Faye Greenberg. I'm here with your tip for today to create momentum in your career. Okay, these are just some things that you should be doing uh, to help level up your career right now so that you can be found, so that people can find you and watch your fabulous talents on display because isn't that what we all wanna do? Okay, so number one, if you haven't ever done this, do it. Number one, Google yourself. Google yourself and see what pops up. If you cannot be easily located in a Google search, then you need to fix that, okay? How do you fix that issue? Well, you need to sh keep sharing your content and the original from the original place where it's stemming from. So for instance, if your website is not showing up on the first page of a Google search, then you need to start sharing that often. Also, if your domain name isn't your name.com or .net or whatever, it's going to have a hard time showing up for you in a Google search. So make sure that you start sharing your website and make sure that on your website, you have somebody help you with the SEO so that you can put your name in there and put some keywords in there that will help you pop up in a Google search. The more people that visit your website, the more that it's going to be readily available on a Google search. And you really wanna be able to have a casting director or a manager or an agent or a theatrical producer or whomever Google you and find you. So hopefully that first thing that they can find is your website. That's especially imperative for those of you that might have similar names to others. That may also mean that in your domain name, if somebody like had the same name as me, Kimberly Faye Greenberg, um, there is a Faye Greenberg out there, but there's not a Kimberly Faye Greenberg. But if there was another person like me, it might mean that I'm Kimberly F. Greenberg or Kimberly Faye Greenberg actor or Kimberly Faye Greenberg singer or something, something that has your full name in there so that we can locate you. Uh, also, in a Google search, do your social media handles come up? Not necessarily as important, but your social media handles should have your name in them. It should not be some kitschy, funny name, at least not while you're not uh, a star and people don't necessarily know you. Uh, you want people to be able to locate you by going onto Instagram, by going onto Facebook, by going onto Twitter, typing in your name, and then you pop up. So just make sure that your handles on all those social media outlets have your real name or some portion thereof that's easily figure outable that it is you. In addition, what else comes up in a Google search? Are there things that you don't want to be found? Uh, if so, then you need to figure out how to get rid of those things by going to the websites they originate from and taking them down. Uh, does your YouTube channel show up? Do you have videos that show up in a Google search? Make sure, that way people can find you and watch your work. It's ultra, ultra important, especially now when auditions are not happening in person. If somebody is looking for you, they need to be able to find you. And again, last but not least, make sure that your social media handles and your social page pages are emulating who you are as a human as well as talent wise. So make sure that you're giving them a good well-rounded view of who you are, what you enjoy, what you appreciate, as well as showing off what you do talent wise as an actor. That might mean showing production photos, showing videos, singing some songs, uh, doing a monologue, whatever the case might be. Uh, from your creative standpoint. Don't worry about being perfect. We're not interested in perfection, especially on social. It moves too quickly. We just want to get a good indication of who you are and what you offer the performing arts community. Okay, I hope you enjoyed my tip for today. Please keep DMing me more questions. Uh, I'd like to thank those of you who have been watching this video who came to my cover letter and standout submissions class today. Thank you so, so, so much. I'm so excited to see more of you. I have two more sessions coming up this week and I cannot wait to see some more of your beautiful faces. So if you want to sign up for that, click on the Google um, form link within this post. It's five bucks. I hope to see you there. I'm answering a lot more uh, specific questions there. So, and I'm hoping that to help you all work smarter, not harder, especially in your submissions. Okay, so give me a shout out. Hope you enjoy this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.